And I'm a very conservative guy from Indiana. I'm from the Midwest. I did not start my company with any expectation that we were going to run for a long period of time before we got to break even. I never considered a heavy investment to start the company. We've been very fortunate. We made an initial investment to start the company that we overcame in about two weeks. And our costs are, are much more variable than they are fixed. For those of you who knows what that is, it would make sense. Some of you may not. You'll learn that over the next few years here on campus. Um, and as a result, um, financially, we've been fortunate because we never start out, started out with the idea of taking losses. And we haven't had a year that's been unprofitable. We haven't had a month that's been unprofitable. We haven't had a week in our company's history that hasn't been profitable. Um, as I mentioned, I, I'm not a big risk taker, and I, I don't know for what reason that would be, whatever it is. Um, that's the way that I conduct business. I haven't taken big risks in our industry. I've seen people who have taken much bigger risks than we have, and a lot of those companies aren't around. I don't think the wine industry and the business that I am in is very rewarding to people who take gigantic risks. And um, so far in what we do, that, that's worked out fairly well. Um, at the end of the day, what we're about is making great products that our customers need. And I, I think the better we're able to do that, the more successful we've become. And ultimately, we do a lot of things as a company. And we try not to be complicated in what we do. But at the end of the day, we have to make products that our customers really need and that are important to them. And that's probably the most critical thing that we do.